Hello viewers, today I'll show you how to make a secret rare recipe from the kitchens of the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan who built the Taj Mahal. I have updated the recipe slightly and it is called Meetha Zafrani Gosht or Kaliya Chashnidar. For this recipe, I'll be using 1 kg of male or khasi goat meat diced on the bone, 2 large red onions sliced, 4 teaspoons chopped ginger, 4 teaspoons roughly pounded coriander seeds, some whole cloves, peppercorns, 2 black cardamoms, 1 teaspoon each of black pepper powder, green elaichi powder, dalchini powder and 3 4 teaspoon clove powder. The juice of 1 lime. Some saffron soaked in warm water. 8 teaspoon crushed almond powder. Around 400 milliliters of sugar syrup or chashni of 1 string consistency and some ghee. Put some ghee in a cast iron pot. In the olden days it would be cooked entirely in ghee but I am adding oil to make a lighter version of this recipe. Add the whole spices to the pot. Give them a stir. Add the sliced onions into the pot and fry the onions for a few minutes. Then add the khashi goat meat pieces into the pot along with the chopped ginger, the crushed coriander seeds and mix them in. Add 2 teaspoons of salt. and add enough water to cook the meat. Give the pot a stir. Bring it to a boil, then put the lid on and cook on low flame for one hour. After an hour, take the lid off and check to see if the meat is tender and it is. Now add the ground almond powder into the pot along with the powdered spices, the saffron water and give the pot a good mix to blend everything and simmer for 2 minutes. Then add the sugar syrup or chashni into the pot and stir the pot. Now it's time to add the lime juice and blend it in and our delicious chashnidar meetha zafrani ghost is ready. Let's plate up this secret Mughlai ghost dish. You can see that it looks very different from your usual meat dishes. Garnish with some strands of saffron or zafran and serve with pulaos or naans. Meetha Zafrani Gosht is a totally unique Mughlai cuisine recipe that has been almost forgotten. This is a true heritage recipe from the Mughal kitchens and it uses mostly locally available ingredients rather than chilies or tomatoes which had not yet been fully introduced into India from the new world. Give this recipe a try and enjoy.